Okay, Kelly. So we're on the Bank of America website, yeah. and uh, it's my understanding you're a current customer of Bank of America. Is that I right? am a current customer with them, and I'm not happy with them at all, actually, right now. Okay. Last week, I had to get a check, and you would think that if you're out of checks, easily they'll give you another one. I had to wait in line on my lunch break for over an hour. There's no reason that you should have to wait that long in line at Bank of America. They need more tellers, especially on a lunch break. There were three people there waiting forever. Uh -huh. Then they were actually going to charge me for a cashier's check. Uh -huh. Who charges uh -huh. their client? I've been with them for 10 years. Mm -hmm. Why would they charge me for an extra check? I yeah, I, I, I'm not sure. And I, I'm I, so I wish, annoyed uh, with them right now. I, I wish you had a better experience, and I, I feel <sighs> bad about that. Um, have you been on their website before? Yeah, I've been on their website before. Okay. It's not any better. Uh, well, we're going to look very specific today, actually. And what I'd like you to focus on is, uh, let's say the scenario was you're, you're buying a, a new home, and uh, you want to find out what mortgage rates they have currently for a 30-year fixed loan. Which I've done that before, and every time I call in, nobody's helpful. Every mm -hmm. single time I call and I inquire about a mortgage, it's like nobody knows what they're doing over there. And I have to sit on hold forever. I oh, mean, dear. it is yeah, the most that. frustrating thing. Yeah, that, I'm sorry. That's I can imagine I that could would be I could go on for days about um, the different experiences. But, but let's see, perhaps in this case of the website, what would serve you in this particular case. And okay. it would be great if you could think out loud as you go through the site. That would be incredibly helpful to know what you're thinking. Okay. So I'm looking for a mortgage. Mm -hmm. Well, there's a banner there. Of course, they're screaming at you to take your money. Um, no, I don't want this. See, I don't want to call them. I've already called them so many times, and they don't know what they're doing every single time call. Um, all right, let's look at a mortgage here. Wow, that's a bit high, don't you think? That's very expensive. I would not... And just tell not me when you feel like you found the information that I'd asked you to, to look for. Well, I guess the information's here, but, I mean, these numbers are outrageous. I don't think it's... So how would you... So in terms of being able to find that information, how, how would you... Uh, I guess first, did you feel like you were able to find the information? I mean, yeah, I guess it was right at the top. It was really easy, but, I mean, still, I think that they need to lower their prices. I think they need to have an easier way than just a drop-down menu. There should be much more advantages for being a long-time customer. They should yep, have something that's that. much more beneficial mm -hmm. rather than the prices that they're offering here. I just don't think it's quite fair. I could understand that, and, and that, that's important feedback, so we can understand that. Um, I, I really would like to understand, though, from the website's experience, um, is there anything they could do to make it easier to get to this information? Um, I guess it's okay. I guess it was relatively easy to find. Okay. But... And, and let's see if we can find, um, let's see if you want to understand for um, uh, your situation, let's say we're interested in spending Two hundred thousand dollars on a home, and you wanted to put down fifteen thousand. Um, can you show me how it would help you find out exactly how much you'd be paying per month? Is there is there a is there some sort of? There's no way that I'm doing mortgages with them. I mean, this is just outrageous. The types of places, but I guess I would go here. Um, let's see. Probably the most outrageous loans are going to give me, and I'm sure if I called and inquired as well about this, that I'd be on hold forever, and that's no help. Okay. Um, well, let's see how it goes operators. on the website. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I guess I would do more or less I'm looking for a home range around here. Okay. Um, a down payment. I don't know. Uh, well, uh, maybe let's just say 50000 Okay. 50000 Then I would see the... Re oh, see, there's always an issue. Down payment needs to be at least... Uh, so, so what is it telling you in this case? Of course there's an error there, and it's telling we have to put a down payment of at least 20% of the purchase I've made, which, I mean, I don't think that they should give me those types of exclusions, but... So they say, so it says 20%, so what does that mean to you in this particular situation? What number would you put in this box? Um, I guess I have to put a higher rate for them. Fine. Let's see if I get the rates here. So expensive these days to buy houses, isn't it? It's incredible. I mean, uh, so let, let's see what they came up with here. No, this is no good. I'm not happy with this. Okay, can you tell me specifically what um, what, what you don't like in this case? 
It's just too expensive. I'm not buying a house. I mean, okay. Uh, so let, let's talk about this particular screen, though, for a okay. moment. So, uh, based on the information you provided, um, is there any information that you don't see here that would be important for you? Mm. I guess it's all there. Okay. All right. Um, great. Anything else you'd suggest uh, in order to get you to this information faster or whatever? In a more uh, a way that would be better suited for you. Um, no, I just think that their website could probably be a little bit faster. Sometimes loading time takes a lot longer, and it shouldn't take as long as it does. One time I was on their website waiting for like an hour for the same page to load. I think yeah. their site was crashing. Yeah, sorry to hear that. Uh, it could be a lot faster. Okay, that that's very useful feedback, and I'll make sure that gets to the right people. So, and okay. thank you, Kelly. I appreciate your time okay. today.